Y'all know nothing about this, you need to pay attention. Sit back and relax, it's time for Goodall's Country Kitchen. Down here in the heart of St. Matthews, Shelbyville Road, Plains Bakery. Okay, as you know, I have already done Heitzman's, I've done Nord's, and this is the third part of the old time family owned neighborhood bakery trilogy. So, Plains uh, has been around since 1922. Kuno Plain came from Germany and opened up first generation 101 years ago and his bakery has now been passed down four generations which i guess now the people running it uh kuno plain would be the like their great great grandfather okay so anyway they're known for uh rolls uh pastries cakes donuts they got it all and it even has like an old time lunch counter type thing in there. It's old timey, and y'all know I'm all about the old school. Uh, it's really cold out here, so we're gonna talk more. We'll be right back in just a okay, minute. Okay, we're in here, and this place is packed. So that ought to let you know something. Uh, I've never been in a place that's crowded before. And you see, I was telling you about that old time lunch counter. Haley and Mary are sitting there. Haley, Mary. Yep, they're holding some seats for us. And uh, once this place clears out, I'm gonna get in line and order something. But, sir, how long has this place been here, this location? 1924. Well, in this particular location? Okay, so this place has been here since 1924. So it's going on 100 years old right here. So they must have had another location for a year before Kuno Plain moved it here. As you see, they got the old time milkshake machine. Uh, you never know, we might go ahead and get one of those in a little bit. But right now we're concentrating on the donuts. You see here, they got the, the cakes. A whole lot of assortment here. Chocolate eclairs. Of course, German chocolate. There's a lot of German influence here. And I'm looking for the kuka. I might have to get one of those butter kukas. I'm gonna see what they got. And we got more cakes over here. All of this is homemade, by the way. None of it's outsourced. And I know they're really known for their rolls. Uh, I guess they do a lot of catering, weddings and stuff, and they do homemade rolls. And look at these frosted covered cookies. They're also known for that. I might have to get one of those for the road. And then of course we got the regular chocolate chip. All kinds of different things in here. Wow, fat man's paradise is what this is. Oh, and they, these are those buns I was telling you about. Those would go good with like some baked country ham sandwiches. And look back there. No shortage of frosted cookies. Wow. Just can't get over all the assortment here. Unbelievable. There's those kookas I was telling you about. I got the runny butter kooka, which I'll show you here in just a second. And look at those donuts and bear claws. Wow, this is just incredible. Also order deli sandwiches. You see they slice the meats right there. Got a deli case, selection of uh, country ham, turkey, all kinds of different things there. And they make sandwiches to order. And you need them right here at your lunch counter. Okay, so it's donut time. And you got the chocolate, didn't you, Haley? Go ahead, dig in. Mary? You got the glazed. What do you think? It's really soft. Light and fluffy. 
So that's what I like. I like the light and fluffy ones instead of the heavy and the rich ones. Oh, and there's my long john right there. Y'all know I like those long johns. I'll be back in a minute to, that, uh, to try that and a couple other surprises. We'll be right back. Mary's washing it down with that cold milk. Oh yeah, Kuno Plain would be proud. I'm sure he's looking down just proud of seeing all his generations carrying on the tradition. All right, so it's time for the Long John. And it is cream filled, I see. Raspberry jelly on the top. Mm, mm, mm. This kind of like uh, Nord's is light, fluffy. I guess the old time German bakeries made their uh, donuts and things uh, light and airy. Mm. All right, that's very good. But now, this is what I came for. Well, one of the things I came for, the butter kuchen. Sam Stallings turned me on to this 30 years ago. He said that the butter kuchen at Plains was the best kuchen in town. About ready to let you know. Where's my plate? Here it is. I'm just gonna scoot that over. And then and this is the runny kuka. Look here. Look here. See how it's running? Look at that. That goodness is just coming out there. It's filled with uh, I guess it's just made basically with butter and sugar. I'll ask somebody for sure here in just a second. All right. Wow. That looks gooey and great. Mm. Mm. Oh, my. That's one of the best things I ever had. All right. I'm going to tell you this right now before I even give final thoughts. I've had Kukas at Heitzman. I had them at Nord's. Plains has cornered the market on the Kukas. Everybody's got their own little niche. This is definitely there. Mm. Mm. All right, be back in a minute. We're going some of this kuka. Haley, you want to try it? Okay. All right. I'm going to work on more of this kuka, and I'll be back with uh, another item in just a second. All right. What do you think of the kuka, Mary? I think it's amazing. That is about one of the best things I've ever had before, as far as dessert-wise goes. Usually not a big dessert person, but that's got to be one of the best things on earth right there. All right. Going to be back in a second and see. I might even order some more stuff. So, uh, Mary, any thoughts on that? I want this to be my birthday cake. Okay. Well, whatever Mary wants, Mary gets. So it looks like we're coming back here in July for Mary's birthday for her kuka birthday cake man that is just so good this is so good i gotta use this end piece here to sop up that gooey goodness mm. wash it down with some milk all right 
Be back in just a second. As I was telling you about the deli sandwiches and everything, there's their menu. To get a good idea of what you can come in here and order. I'll tell you what, if I hadn't eaten that butter kooka, I'd be getting me one of those country ham sandwiches right now. Anyway. Haley. Anything else? All right, I guess that's a wrap. We'll be back in just a second with some closing thoughts. I almost forgot the last thing, these iced cookies. And before I get into this, uh, don't let me forget, they have really good king cakes here. So next month for Mardi Gras, Fat Tuesday, be sure you get in there, order you a king cake. And uh, any catering or anything like that, they do big time catering. So keep that in mind the next time you're having like a big party, wedding, graduation heaven forbid a funeral anyway i want to try out this ice cookie before we get out of here mm. that is so good soft mm. anybody got any, anybody got any milk left yep I have that milk. <laughs> All right. So, looks like that's going to be it. And y'all don't know nothing about this Plains Bakery. Now you know the facts of why I'm on a mission. You're always welcome back to Goodall's Country Kitchen.